Hello. Oh, wow. Hi, hi. Good afternoon. Hello, teacher. I am. Yes. Hello, Tung. Hello, Hi Min. How are you today? Are you feeling happy? Yes. Yes, very good. Okay, so you look handsome in your haircut. Your haircut looks good. Okay, so are you now ready to learn, Hymen? Yes or no? Ready to yes. learn? Yes, okay. So let's continue our lesson today in Unit 3 entitled, What is Your Name? Okay, so last time, let's have a quick review. We learned this name. So can you, can you please repeat after teacher? You say Ben. Ben. Very good. Sam. Sam. Next, you say her name is Lucy. Lucy. Very good. You say Nick. Nick. Very good. He is Nick. He is Nick. Okay, next, Bill. Bill. He is Bill. He is Bill. Very good. Next, Anne. Anne. She is Anne. She is Anne. Very good. Next, Tom. His name is Tom. Tom. Yes, next, Kim. Kim. She is Kim. Kim. Okay, very good. And here, we also discuss the names for girls and boy. Is that right, Hymen? Okay, so you repeat after teacher, you say Dan. Dan. Ben. Ben. Nick. Nick. Andy. Andy. Very good. Bill. Bill. And Tom. Tom. Yes, Sue. Sue. Anna. Anna. May. May. Jill. You. Anne. Anne. Tracy. Tracy. Lucy. Lucy. Alex. Alex. Pat. Sam. Sam. And Kim. Kim. Okay, very good. So can you please give teacher the name for, a name for boy, a boy? You give me at least one name for boy. Dan. Yes, Dan, very good. How about for girl? Girl, you give me a name for girl. We have okay. Anna. Yes, Anna. Very good. How about for boy and girl? Sam Kim. Yes, Sam and Kim. Very good. So this time. Okay, so we are done with this. 
Okay, so kindly look at this one. So, mister, here, when we say mister, this is for a man. Okay? A man. When we say a man, that is a boy like you. For example, we say Mr. Ride. So this one is a man. Do you understand, Hymen? Yes? I don't know. Uh -huh. Okay. So here, when we say this one, Mr. You read this, Mr. Yes. When we when we use Mister, we refer to a man. That means a boy. Okay. So Mister Ride is a boy. Okay. How about Mrs. Okay. So you repeat after me. You say Mrs. Mrs. Very good. This one is for a girl. For example, Mrs. Duck. Okay, so this is for girl. Okay. Mrs. is for girl who is married. Okay, so what is Mrs.? Is it a boy or for a girl? I don't know. Okay, so kindly look at your screen here. Mrs. is for a woman. For example, we have Mrs. Duck. Mrs. Duck is a girl who is married. Okay, Hymen, do you understand, teacher? Yes? Do you understand, teacher? Okay, so here, let's proceed to miss. When we say miss, you repeat after teacher, miss. You repeat after teacher, Hymen, you say miss. Miss. Very good. Or M. M, S, then dot. Or just like this one. When you see this one, it is used for a girl or woman that is single. Okay. A girl or woman who is single. For example, here we have Miss A.M. Okay. Miss A.M. is me. I am called Miss because I am a girl or a woman who is single. Okay, just like you. Okay, for example, we have here, Mr. Mr. I will, I will put you here, Mr. Min. Okay, because I use Mr. Min because Min is a boy. Do you understand? Yes. What is the name of your mother? What's the name of your mother? Tuk. What's the spelling? This one, Tuk? Yes. T okay. C-R-U-C. C-R-U-C? Crook? C. Ah, truck. This one. C R U C. C. This one. C R U C. C. C T. T. Ah, T. Yeah, this one. T R U C. Is this right? Yes. Okay. So we call your mother Mrs. Truck. Because your mother is a woman who is married. Do you understand? Okay, and here we call Miss A.M. Because teacher A.M. is a single woman. Okay? 
Okay. So, when we say mister, is it a girl or a boy? Mister, is it a girl or a boy? When we use, okay, hi, Min, you listen to teacher? Yes, Mr. Min, is it a girl or boy? Boy or girl? Mr. Min, who is Mr. Min? Boy. Boy, very good. How about Mrs. Mm. Strook? Yes, that is you. How about Mrs. Strook? Is it a girl or a boy? Who is Mrs. Strook? Girl or a boy? Girl or boy? Who is Mrs. Strook? Is it a girl or a boy? Girl, very good. How about Miss A.M.? Girl. Girl. Okay, so we use Miss for girl and also Mrs. for a girl and Mr. for a boy like you. Okay, do you understand? Do you understand, Hymen? I don't know. Okay, so yes, you understand. What is the name for I? What do I? When we when we say Mister, this is refer for a boy. We call a man or a boy Mister and a woman Missus. Okay, and Miss for a single girl or woman. Okay, so this time, let's proceed to our next slide. So here, you listen again and you write the names. Okay, Hymen? 3C. What's your name? Listen and write the names. One. Hello, Lucy. Is that your brother? Yes. What's his name? Tom. Is that T-O-M? Yes. Two. Have you got a good friend at school? Yes. What's her name? Alex. Do you spell that A-L-E-X? Yes. She's very nice. Okay. So what is the name of the girl? Who is the girl? Okay. Wait. This is the girl's school friend. So who is that? This is... This is the girl's school friend. Who is that? We have Alex. Okay, so we have Alex. A-L-E-X. Yes, we have Alex. So let's listen to number two and you listen to the grandmother's name. Okay, Hymen? Yes. Three. What's your teacher's name? Mr. Ride. How do you spell that? R I D E. Oh, yes, I know him. Okay, so who is an English teacher? What's the name of the English teacher? <laughs> yes, you are correct. I am your English teacher, but according to what you've listened, it is teacher wide. Okay. Wide is an English teacher. Okay. So you listen to the names and you write it. Okay, Hymen? Yes. Okay. 
Okay, so you listen again to the names. Four. What's your grandmother's name? Her name's May. Can you spell that? Yes. It's M A Y. Five. Yes, yeah, so what is the name of the grandmother? Yes, what's the name of the grandmother? Wait, let's I will let you listen again. Okay, so you listen to this one and you tell me the name of the grandmother. It's M A Y. Yes, it's M. I know him. You listen, you listen. Four. What's your grandmother's name? Her name's May. Can you spell that? Yes, it's M. A Y. Yes, so who is the name of the grandmother? What's the name of the grandmother? Who? No, this one is May. M A Y. Okay, so you listen again to the dog's name. Okay? Yes. Five. Is that your dog, Tom? Yes. What's its name? Her name's Happy. Happy? How do you spell that? H A P P Y. That's a good name for a dog. Okay, so what is the dog's name? Happy, very good. Can you please write happy? You write happy. Okay, wait, let me give you your pen. You can write happy in number three. Please write happy in number three. Ha, huh? very good. Happy. What is the spelling for happy? Happy, happy. What's the spelling for happy? Yes. H. Yes. Oh. Happy. Why? Yes, happy. this is happy. Very good. Okay. So this time, let's check if all your answers are correct. May, happy, very good. And Mrs. Duck. Okay. So this time, let's proceed to our party. And you're going to answer the questions. Then you write your names in the circle. Can you see the circle? Can you see? Okay, as you can see, we have a circle on the right side. And you write the names in this circle. Okay. <coughs> Okay, so what's your name? You write your name. Wait for a while. I'll give you your pen. What's your name? What's your name? Yeah. 
What's your name? Yes, what's your name? You write your name. Hymin. So you write Hymin in the circle. T. T. You write, you write. This one, oh, I can write. You use your keyboard. No, no. Oh, wait. I will give you your pen. T. Okay, T. 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 What? O. O. And N. This one? N. No. Again, again. Okay. What is you? What is your name? C O N G. C O N G. Ah, Tong. T O N G. O-N-G. This one? Yes. Okay, oh, what's your friend's yes. name? What's your friend's name? Friend's name, your friend's name. Theo. Hi, Theo. What's your friend's name? You spell. What's your friend's name? T. Can you hear me or not? T. What's next? Can you hear me or not? P. I. Okay, so I. No. What? So, okay. T R. T R E. E. T R. I. E U. This one. You spell again. T R. No. T. T. R. R. T. R. No, no. T. R. I. I. Yes. I. E. U. Yes. Ah, true. What's your grandmother's name? Hi. What? Can you please? T. Wait for a while. What's your grandmother's name? T. H. I. N. H. Tan? Yes. Okay. So, what's a good name for a cat or a dog? What's a good name for a cat or a dog? I don't know. Okay, so let's name this one as Max. Okay, so you say, My name is Tong. Very good. Then you say, my friend's 
name is true. Okay, you say my friend's name is true. Okay, then you say again, my grandmother's name is Tan. Okay. Oh. Yes, yes. Okay, so next, my dog's name is Max. Can you please repeat after teacher? You say, my friend's name is True. My friend's name is True. Very good. Next is, my name is Chong. My name is Chong. Very good. You say, my grandmother's name is Tan. My grandmother's name is Tan. Very good. Next, my dog's name is Max. My dog's name is Max. Okay, very good. So that's a good job for you. So let's proceed to our answer the question. Write your names in the circle. Okay, we are on this one. Okay, so you say, my name is Tracy. My name is Tracy. Okay, then this one you say, my friend's name is Jenny. My friend's name is Jenny. Very good. My grandmother's name is Kate. My grandmother's name is Kate. Very good. A good name for cat or dog is Smile. A good name for cat or dog is Moo. Okay, you say again, Smile. Smile. Okay, very good. Because of that, I will give you a cupcake. Do you like cupcake? Yes. Okay, very good. So this time, let's proceed to part E and you are going to listen and write the names or the numbers, okay? Okay. Okay, so before that, let's listen first. 3E. What's your name? Listen and write. One. Mom, can you help me? Okay. Can you tell me Mary's family name? Yes, it's Dor. D O O R. Okay, so what is the family name of Mary? What is the family name of Mary? Hello. Okay, so you listen. Okay, I will let you let you listen again. One. Mom, can you help me? Okay. Can you tell me Mary's family name? Yes, it's Dor. D O O R. Okay, so what is Mary's family name? Door. Door. Can you spell door? I don't know. Okay, so this is D O O R. D O O R. Yes, okay, so let's listen to number two. D O O R. Thanks. Two. And what's the number of Mary's house? 17. 
She lives at number 17. Oh, yes. Three. Okay, so what is the number of Mary's house? What is the number of Mary's house? Seventeen. Okay, very good. So you're right. Seventeen here. Okay, great job. How about number three? You listen to number three. And what's the name of the street? You know that. It's Lime Street. Do you spell that L I M E? That's right. L I M E. Great. Thanks. Okay, so what's the name of their street? Green. Okay, so that one is lime. You say lime. Lime street. Very good. Okay, so let's proceed to our letter part F. It is entitled, It's Your Friend's Birthday. So you write your friend's name and the address of your friend. Can you please write? Okay, so for example, we have Tracy Potter. This is my friend, Tracy Potter. And her address is 294 Lemon Street in London. Okay, so can you please write your friend's name? No, your friend's name. What's your friend's name? True. True. Okay, so what is his address? Address. Where does True live? I don't know. How about you? Where do you live? I don't know. Okay, so here, let's say that your friend's name is Teacher A.M. Yes, and Teacher A.M.'s address is Zone 1, Obsid Street, Malay Balai City. Okay, so you say Zone 1, Obsid Street, Malay Balai City. Can you please, what is your friend? Yes, so what is your friend's name? It's? Trio. No, you say Teacher A.M. Who is your teacher's name? Very good. And where does teacher AM live? Zone one. Office. Okay, very good. Because of that, you have a star from teacher AM. Okay, very good. Yes, it's a star for you. Fantastic. Okay, so this time, let's proceed to our next slide. So here, you're going to find a name from A in this sentences. Okay, for example... To me, okay, so here you're going to find a name from A. 
Okay, so for number, we have an example in number two. Okay, so here we have from A. Yes, on this story. And we have an apple, grandma, letter A, clean and add. Okay, so do you want to play a game? Yes. Okay, then let's play a game. Wait for a while. Let me check what time is it. Okay, so let's have a let's have a game. So hello. What's your name? My name is Teacher AM. How about you? What's My your name? Teacher AM. Yes. So this time we are going to play a game. Okay, it is entitled Spelling Games. Okay, so here, let's have this one. Spe play the game. Spelling game. Spelling game. Okay, can you please spell the, the name? Okay, here, wait for a while. Okay, so in our spelling name, I'm going to tell you one name and you spell it. For example, teacher AM will say, you spell the name Anna. So you write A-N-N-A, -N -N -A, Anna. Okay, how about you spell the name Sam? Can you spell the name Sam? Sam. Can you please spell the name Sam? What? S. S. S -A -M. Very good. How about Ben? Can you please spell the name Ben? B-E-N. B-E-N. Very good. How about Alex? Can you spell the name of Alex? A very good. How about Min? Can you spell your name? Min. What's your name? Hello, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Hello, Min. Can you hear teacher? Hello, what na nabuang na jud? Nawala na ko sujante.
to be as for as this too. Okay, so if you just want to do a big move, play it again. So these are the things that some of the work in this semester is going to be doing. Let's do this one on the So your next test will be based on. So I'm coming back to the heart of worship and all about you. So use the word maybe hard talk for things. Hello, Min. Hello, Min. Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. <laughs> yes. Okay. So this time, since it's almost time, I will just extend my time for your homework. Okay, so this is your homework for today's class. 
you're going to record yourself answering this question. What's your name? How old are you? And what are your parents' name? For example, I will say, hello, my name is Teacher AM and I'm 25 years old and my parents' name is Peloche and Ronaldo. Okay, so this is your homework and I'll send this one in Zalo. Okay, so do you have any question to me? No? Okay, so let's sing this goodbye song. I can clap my hands I can stamp my feet I can clap my hands I can stamp my feet Bye bye goodbye Bye 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 goodbye Bye bye Okay, so goodbye, Min. See you next time. Bye, bye, teacher. Yes, keep safe always. Bye-bye.